There are literally hundreds, if not thousands, of remedies for low back pain. They're almost all scams. In this video, we're going to show you what science says actually works for back pain, how to get relief, when to reach out, and who can best help. Let's start with what works. Guidelines based on reputable science recommend the three things that are proven to help with nonspecific low back pain. They're first modalities like massage, acupuncture, and spinal manipulation. The second is moist heat. And third and last, if medications are preferred, non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs or skeletal muscle relaxants, not opioids. Don't be dumb, those things can kill you. If you're having severe pain every time you move, then I'd add to that list a low back brace, like the kind you can get at Home Depot for compression. How long should you keep this up at home before seeing a doctor? Three weeks. If you're not better after three weeks, then see your medical or chiropractic doctor. They'll probably prescribe an x-ray. Now, we don't wanna rush and get an MRI too soon. It leads to overtreatment. But if you have nerve root signs at this point, three week MRI and referral to a pain management doctor are appropriate. As we discussed in the last video, the x ray is to screen for a serious condition. But if you're like 99.9% .9 of people, none will be present, and you're clear to start physical therapy or spinal manipulation with your chiropractor. The physical therapist can do modalities like deep tissue ultrasound, as well as recommend exercises to help. Chiropractors do spinal manipulation or treatment with an actuator. It's your job to make sure you don't get too much of a good thing. If you're not better after three weeks of therapy or five visits with the chiropractor, you were now six weeks after your pain began, it's time to reach out for more help. Have your doctor prescribe an MRI don't just see your neighborhood legacy pain pill pusher. Look at the link in our description for our video on how to find a three-star pain management doctor. If you have a radicular type pain, mostly electricity in the leg with associated numbness, weakness, and reflex loss on examination, and the MRI confirms a herniated disc or pinched nerve root, then the right pain management specialist will start with epidural injection. Okay. You've reached nine weeks. If you have spinal stenosis or spondylolisthesis, then you'll need to see a neurosurgeon or orthopedic spine surgeon for laminectomy surgery or possibly even a spinal fusion. They can also treat arthritis of the spine with radiofrequency ablation. Again, look in the description for a link on our video on spinal fusion to learn more. For those who have a herniated disc that didn't get better despite epidural injection, you too will need to see a spine surgeon for microdiscectomy surgery. Back pain really stinks. I'm so sorry you're going through it, but I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, don't be shy. You can reach me through the Phoenix Spine and Joint website. Otherwise, see you in the next video. For best practice, I'm Dr. Dan Lieberman. If you have a question you would like answered on Best Practice Live, there are three ways to ask. Leave a comment on any of our social channels, click the link to our website and complete the submission form, or call or text us at 608-602-4022. The more information you can give us, the better we can answer your question. So please contact us and we can walk you through uploading your imaging to a secure server. Please like and subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with information about your spine and joint.